आईआईटी अरे आईआईटी तो वर्ती नहीं है रे बाबा क्या Is IIT worth your hard work? A question which I usually used to ask myself each and every single time when I felt tired or exhausted. And if you are someone who is preparing for IIT JEE or who might have been in that phase in the past, come on, you know this. It wasn't easy. Recollect it. It was pure work, day in and day out. A hell lot of pressure. A hell lot of self doubt. Days of grinding and consistency. Sometimes you felt that you didn't want to wake up anymore, but you still woke up. You got out of your bed and started solving questions again. Sometimes you put in the same amount of work, but you did not see the result anymore. And did you have an option? No. You just had to continue. Parental pressure. Peer pressure. Pressure of failure. And the list goes on. So is that all worth it? Is IIT worth it? Or is it just the hype? Don't get me wrong, but I won't be able to answer this question. majorly because of the youtube channel that i've built and also i'm still a student at iit kharagpur which means i have no idea how life after iit would look like and i'm not sure how studying in this iit would be helpful for me in the future and that is the reason why i invited a couple of people today a student from iit delhi a recent graduate from iit roorkee and a graduate from iit kharagpur who passed out of iit before like 10 years and i did this because i wanted to cover the entire spectrum of before iit in iit and after iit so now let's ask them the question was iit worth the hard work So we are right in the interview right now, and here we have. Uh, I am Aditya Pratap Singh. I am a third year undergraduate student at IIT Delhi, and I am pursuing a B Tech in Mathematics and Computer. Hi, my name is Krita Gaye, and I am working as a product manager at Razorpay right now. I am a 2020 grad from IIT Roorkee. Hello, everyone. I am Vikrant Kirar, IIT Kharagpur graduate, and I teach physics on my YouTube channel Crashup. After graduation, I started graphic designing. Then I moved into filmmaking, and I have even directed a couple of TV ads. I have done. a lot of music videos and then i decided to switch to be a creator and then i started about 20 25 youtube channels and finally i narrowed down on educational youtube channels and these days i am teaching on crash first question which i'd like to ask you is how many years did you prepare for iit uh, i started my preparation when i was in 10th standard like uh, 10th standard mein I got a lot of questions ki kya karna hai beta ab aage jaake kya karna hai aage jaake so I was like kya karna hai aage jaake I was pondering right away so a uh, few of my colleagues were preparing for J already like people start from 9th and 10th so I was like I am getting late now let's start so midway 10th there is exam called NTSC national dance search examination na so I was preparing for that and somehow uh, I cleared round 1 round 2 and then uh, that was the way forward for me to start and get into the j preparation i had studied for 4 years i started my coaching from 9th 9th 10th 11th 12th i studied for j you can say okay after completing my 10th i really wanted to be in my hometown and not leave it so my hometown is about 70 kilometers from kota the hub of coaching classes but uh, because of lack of internet and everything i had no idea what id j is and there were no teachers in my school because it was a government school so i had no choice but to go to kota so i went there and got enrolled in an a coaching institute and that's how it happened and the next question is like how much was you studying in an iit you coming from an iit helpful for you in your life like when people know that you are from iit how much like do they care about in like, all the kind of advantages that you got from studying in an iit obviously that iit wala tag na is has helped me get through n number of things easily like i remember once once i got i got uh, i was driving so i just skipped the red light and me and my friends were iit ke dost the and they were behind me so the policeman comes and he asks where are you going where are you from so we just said that we from iit delhi and so he said iit ke bachche aajkal bhi bahut bamashi karne lag gaye jao jao so so from getting away from policeman to like uh, even in an interview or like internship we get uh, he's an iit and i don't need to ask you questions about physics chemistry maths you must be very talented they start off i like that so yeah that tag is very beneficial like when i put iit in my linkedin profile i think it definitely adds some weight to it when i tell a distant relative who does not know me that hey i graduated from iit roorkee they definitely see ki oh is bande ne kuch kiya hai acha life mein and they start taking me a little more seriously whenever even i have to escalate something right ki i was talking to a manager level person at uh, some company that i won't name and i was like yaar dekho aap mere ko mat sikhao yaar dekho hum bhi i hum it sector mein hain kyunki unko wahi wording samajhte hain right aur fir mere papa ne bola ki yaar 
यार आईआईटी का पढ़ा हुआ बच्चा है यार आपको मतलब उसका आपको क्या लगता है इसको टेक्नोलॉजी नहीं समझेगी बोलते अच्छा आईआईटी से पढ़े हुए हो क्या आपको बात नहीं अपन देख लें व्हेन आई लुक बैक इट्स आई वोंट से इट्स दैट यूजफुल बिकॉज़ आई कुड हैव गॉन टू अ फिल्म स्कूल एंड इवन पॉलिश माय स्किल्स इवन बेटर बट एट दैट टाइम when we had no internet i had no access to information about what i should do after my 10th class so uh, going to kota to study something was the only option for me and what was that something i was inclined toward uh, engineering so i had to choose itj i think it helped me a lot in getting uh, good clients or <laughs> get a good support for my ventures like i was doing graphic graphic designing and all almost all of my clients were my friends from id kharagpur who were doing their startups so we were all kind of supporting each other in that ecosystem and that network really helps you so the last question is like do you think that preparing for iit all the work that you have put in was worth it uh if i would have to uh say in one line that is iit the worth the effort i put in for preparation the worth uh, the worth it i would say yes because iit is the best college in our country like my experience over the 3 years of my iit i have been interacting with a lot of smart people around me wo sab bolne ki baatein hoti hain ki you know iit is the best institute it's it's the best institute because Uh, the people there are the best i i remember a quote someone said i don't know who said it like if you are in the smartest in the room you are in the wrong room na when i got to iit there hasn't been a single day when i am the smartest in the room that has helped me you know keep learning like koi na koi mere se zyada acha kisi na kisi cheez mein hai if uh, if people are considering iit preparation as something to get into a good college and get, grab a good job i would beg to differ that it's not as worth like you have to put a lot of effort it's very competitive especially if you are if you are preparing for iit j and top 7 institutes you have to compete with like bahut zyada mushkil hai and to get into a college uh, abroad with the same prospects it's much easier you can get a job anywhere from any you can graduate from any institute any decent in- engineering institute but those four years where you get to interact where your personality develops where you get to interact with so many smart people that i am sure no one can get you in this country ha it's worth the hard work for sure ki i have put in 16 hours a day and i got into it it's definitely worth spending 16 hours a day i did not spend 16 hours a day i spent like 5 hours a day but it's worth spending like even 10 hours if someone is spending if it's worth spending 10 hours a day for 2 years to get into iit yes that is worth it jab main aaj se mud ke dekhta hu kyunki meri trajectory itni ut padang rahi hai main graphic designer tha fir main youtube bhi kar raha hu main film making bhi kar raha hu aur ye sab karne ke liye aapko kahin na kahin back of the mind wo security chahiye hoti hai ki yaar agar main fail karunga to i can any time go back and teach to ye cheez thi to i think iit degree ki wajah se mujhe wo confidence wo peace of mind mili jiske karan main itni sari risk le paya अगर मेरे पास आई टी की डिग्री नहीं होती तो शायद मैं इतनी रिस्क नहीं ले पाता और इसलिए फिर आई टी की डिग्री मेरे लिए बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट हो जाती है नॉट डैट कि वहाँ पे उन्हें क्या सिखाया है वहाँ पे जो नेटवर्क बनता है वो भी अपने आप में एक अलग चीज़ है लेकिन वो कॉन्फिडेंस जो आपको चाहिए होता है वो उस वक्त के लिए बहुत जरूरी हो जाता है सो डू यू गेट एट द आई टी टैग काइंड ऑफ डिफ्रेंशिएट्स यू फ्रॉम अदर्स in terms of initial impressions like the society that we live in the value of tag is obviously there when someone knows that you are from iit they usually start assuming that he okay, can this person is smart this person is kind of dedicated this person is kind of sincere and all these things but that doesn't save you from not being skilled that doesn't save you from not doing any work you still have to put a lot of work after you come into iit and all the extra hype that is created around these colleges it's just the marketing strategy of all these coaching institutions and coming back it's not just about the initial impressions studying in a good college also gives you a head start in your career because it's lot more easier for a tier 1 college student to get placed in a company when compared to a tier 3 college student so there are definitely a lot of advantages and the list of advantages are the topic of discussion for some other day but coming to the conclusion is iit worth your hard work i would say yes it definitely is taking into consideration several different factors so if you are someone who is going to give your je try to give your best the hard work would definitely pay off but i also want you to remember that all the extra hype and statements like agar iit nahi hua to kuch nahi hoga is just pure bullshit there are a lot of people who are not from iits who still do great in their life so this examination which is fucking up your mind is not the end of the life but that shouldn't stop you from giving your best in it in fact it's just going to add to your life so why not give your best 
So yeah, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And yeah, if you are a JEE aspirant who is going to give the examination this year, there's a small workshop that we are conducting today and tomorrow from 8 p.m. to 8:45 p.m. Like just 45 minutes ka session. And in that session, we would be talking about the best principle that you need to follow to give the best in your examination. So this would be helpful for each and every one of you. Like we'll help you build the right mindset to give the best in your examination. So don't miss the session. Very valuable. I'll give the link of the session in the description below. Use the code THERI and TARUN to join it for free. And if you are someone who needs the best JE notes to prepare, you can join the telegram below. So with that being said, thank you so much for 150k. Like, <sighs> thanks a lot man. And I'll see you very soon. Bye-bye.